My name is Chris Williams, I'm 28, and I'm from Houston, Texas. When I was growing up, I never touched drugs, never smoked a cigarette, never did any of that. And it wasn't until I got to college, uh, I went to Texas Tech for computer science. And there I was introduced to weed and uh, cigarettes and uh, all that. When I was 25, me and my mom, we got into an argument, a little benign, dumb fight. And then uh, a week later, uh, she passed away. Um, I found her dead in bed. It destroyed my whole perception of life and reality. I stopped caring about a lot of things. So for a full year, I really didn't leave my house. I quit my job. I found amphetamines, uh, you know, meth, Adderall, ecstasy. I, I blew all caution to the wind and just, because I had no one to disappoint. I ran out of money. I didn't know where to go. And uh, my family, they all turned their backs on me. I was homeless for three days in uh, downtown Houston. So this pastor came up and uh, he was passing out sandwiches, he was passing out blankets, which I needed. And I was like, whoa, you know. So he gave me the blanket and, you know, some food. And then uh, I went back up to him. I said, hey, thank you. I really appreciate it. And uh, the pastor, he looked at me and he said, do you want to change your life, son? And I said, of course I do. And I do not want to be here. And so he gave me his card and he said, call me when you are ready. And so I called him the next day, and he brought me to Shantar. Before, you know, I could say I didn't care. I didn't care for God. But coming here, he showed me, like, you know, we have to go through those storms to appreciate a sunny day. That's why I'm here, and that's why I've, I feel I was brought here to, you know, seek out you know, seek out God and get to know him better. And that, you know, he brought me through all that to make me, you know, into something that, you know, that could help, probably help other people. Coming here, I've come to learn that, you know, there are people that care, there are people that love. So that's why I try to, you know, you know, be better. It was cool, um, I guess, rebuilding, rebuilding my faith.